Hi guys, this is Rishabh Kapoor from websofttutorials.com. In this video guys, we'll talk about jQuery text function. With jQuery text function guys, you can insert text in HTML element, you can remove it or you can change it. Just take, uh, make a p tag here and I'll make a button here. Input type of button and I'll give it a value of click me and uh, I'll give it a ID of BTN. Firstly, guys, I'll open it in browser. Guys, what I will do when I click this button, then some text will be inserted inside this P tag, and I'll give it a class name of one. So for that, guys, I'll go to external jQuery file, and firstly, I'll make a click event for this btn button so I'll write pound sign btn dot click it's when I click this button then firstly guys we will insert some text inside that p tag who has a class name of one so I'll select I'll write p dot one I mean select that p tag who has a class name of one then dot text and insert some text in it so I'll write in the quotes all right this is the text so I'll refresh it when I click it now you'll see this is the text in the same way guys I can change it so I'll write first I'll write this is the main content so firstly I'll refresh Guys, what will happen? I'll, I'll write this content is coming from jQuery file. Guys, when I click this button, it will overwrite this content or this text with this text. It will overwrite this text with this text so refresh when I click it I can see this is content this content is coming from jQuery file in the same way I can remove it also I'll set it to black means nothing will be nothing no text will be inside uh, this beta so refresh when I click it it will be black now you can see so guys this was about jQuery text function with which you can insert some text you can remove it or you can change it guys this text function only work with text so guys this was about text function if you have any question in your mind then you can leave a comment below so thanks for watching this video guys don't forget to subscribe my channel to get recent updates about my videos let's see you in the next tutorial